partnership, service, action. I would like to move on to a topic close to my heart, the defense of our nation. I have written about it in the Straits Times, debated it in Parliament. It is not an academic topic for me. I grew up in a military family. My father signed on in 1965 at the age of 18, even before NS was formalized, was selected to train as a fighter pilot helped set up squadrons in the SAF. He is here today with my mother and my wife. My father flew in the first Black Knights team. Why did he risk his life? The more important question, why did my own mother agree to him pushing the envelope up there. We were told from young, no one, no one will defend us but ourselves. With the Black Knights flying in the early 70s jets, it made crowds roar, but sent strong messages elsewhere. Don't mess. Today we have the Black Knights and all our servicemen in the Singapore Armed Forces pushing that same envelope. And that same message rings loud and clear today as with every of the five decades of Singapore's sovereignty. It was a message that rang loud and clear when my parents affixed the epaulets on my shoulders during national service and rang loud and clear throughout the ICTs that I served and I'm sure that you served. SDP's proposal to almost half the defense budget will ambush Singapore's sovereignty. They say cut the defense budget to half of what it is today, three, five years time. In this environment, this geopolitical environment that is naive, dangerous, but most of all for discerning voters opportunistic. 